Firefighters demonstrating the truck's capabilities outside St. John's Fire Station Wednesday morning. Fire Chief Elvis Weaver says it's a crucial addition to the brigade's fleet. As we know, um, we, we had a very disastrous fire the other day in, in Grace Farm. And we are really happy that we have been given this fire tender. PLH is the company responsible for the Barbuda Ocean Project and its fire paramedic chief Lee Sagard was at the handover ceremony. Sagard is also a former special constable who was attached to the fire brigade between 2016 and 2020. So I stepped up to PLH management um, with, the, with the support of uh, uh, the fire chief and our PLH leadership and said, can we, can we support the fire department here in Antigua and get this fire truck? I am so happy to see this behind me today because it gets me emotional because we have been waiting so long for a truck that carries a thousand gallons of water and this thing has a 1260 gallon per minute pump. This is a super pumper with a very large water tank on it. Deputy Police Commissioner Everton Jeffers is encouraging PLH and other corporate citizens to continue supporting the fire brigade and the wider police force. If you can help assist us, we are here to work with you to make sure that we make you safe and protect your business from any sort of hazards. The truck which PLH shipped from the US is equipped with a water cannon and the fire officials say it's slender enough to maneuver through narrow streets in some areas of the island. The fire chief says three additional used trucks are scheduled to arrive in August and one brand new one is scheduled for September. From St. John's Fire Station, I am Jamie J. Roche reporting for ABS News.